If someone takes your child away, it is called kidnapping. If the government does it, it is called sympathy. The Journal of Medical Ethics suggested that transgender children be taken away from parents if they will not choose transition therapy. I have many words for the writers, but none are fit for online discourse. We already had a little boy in Texas that had to wait on a judge to decide whether he would stay with his mom who forced him to be a girl or his dad who let him be a boy. Over in the UK, a father was forced to use preferred pronouns for his transgender child. Statistically speaking, children have a higher rate of suicide once the transition is complete, and most grow out of it as time goes on. Apparently, if you want to cut off your maleness, you are perfectly fine and the state needs to intervene to protect you. At least there are not people who pour drain cleaner in their eyes just because they want to be blind. Oh wait, what's this? Well, there are not any people who want to have surgery to become paraplegic. Oh wait, what's this? Both of these people are mentally ill, and if a parent elected to let a child do either of these things, they would be arrested for child abuse. Yet, if you want to mutilate and permanently alter your sex organs, the government must intervene.